Alex, thanks. And happening now, we've reached the end of February and with it, of course, the last day of Black History Month. But the meaning behind the month stretches far beyond the calendar. News 5's Colette Bordelon joins us in studio now with a live look at how groups, different groups in town, are dedicated to diversity here in the Springs. Colette? That's right, Andy. Whether it's planning events to celebrate the culture here or a magazine that highlights black entrepreneurs and creatives, they say it's important to keep learning more about black history and to teach the next generation everything we can. Oh my gosh, look at her. The pages of this magazine. So those beautiful faces. Filled with faces. This is impacting the next generation. Of black professionals, creatives, and entrepreneurs all across Colorado. February Black History Month is important because it's a, it's a time to remember and celebrate all the amazing people that came before us, but it's also a time to create new history right now. Brandon Bournes, the editor-in-chief, says it's a snapshot, encouraging everyone to keep growing. The importance of a diversity of perspective, having people in your workplace, in your environment, that might have a little bit different perspective than you to help bring an overall value to your organization. We also talked to the vice chair of the Pikes Peak Diversity Council. So I've been here 22 years. I'm retired army. Shirley Martinez. There's culture everywhere here. Who brought us back in time. Fannie Mae Duncan, of course, was an African-American woman in the 50s and 60s. She was an African-American entrepreneur and she was told not to let whites into her club. But Duncan had a different idea. Says no, that's not right and that it needs to be everybody welcome. With her message living on long after she was gone. Help us be the Olympic city, but also be everybody welcome. Because Bourne says everybody being welcome is key. We shine brighter together. To keep the spirit of Black History Month going all year long. Oh, great to see. So are there any additional editions of My Black Colorado coming out this year, Colette? Yes, they do four a year, so three more coming out this year. The next three focusing on history, education, and business, but that's not really all that's going on in our area this okay, year. Okay, what else? Yeah, it extends past. So the Pikes Peak Diversity Council says the Gold Room is hosting a Cotton Club event near the end of March. Plus, if you follow certain groups on Facebook, like the Black Chamber or Thrive, they'll keep you updated on anything else that's being planned in our community. Great information. Thanks so much, Colette. Of course. Thanks, Andy. All righty.